guys, Jasmine here. Today we're going to be taking a look at this beautiful mid-century style lamp. The brand is Savafie, I'm not sure how to pronounce it, Savafie, and the style is Enrica, and it is a 66-inch floor lamp currently available on Amazon, and I will link it in the description box below, so feel free to use my link if you found this review helpful. Uh, the tripod lamp it is 66 inches tall. It is a very large and kind of imposing looking lamp. Um, I highly recommend that you measure out your space before purchasing this lamp to make sure that you have enough room for it. Uh, it's 66 inches tall and the space between the legs is 25 inches. So my space is, a, is less than 585 square feet. And when placing this lamp in the living room, it looks, <laughs> it looks like it's the first thing that you notice when you walk in the room. It's like the, the lamp is taking up almost like a quarter of the space, not a quarter, I don't exaggerate. It's taking up so much space in the living room that it looks a little bit comical. So I would suggest this only if you have like a larger amount of space to work with. But even so, I don't regret this lamp. It is a very stylish, very good looking lamp. Assembly was relatively easy, so each pole, you just screw it on. So each pole, there was three parts to each pole. So this one part, two part, three part, and you just screw it on. Um, the the color, it is a little bit, you know. When I was reading the Amazon reviews, some people complained about the color not being perfect. As you know, this is slightly darker than this one, but it, that's not something that I would notice. I don't think anybody would look at a lamp this close. I mean, it doesn't bother me, but it may bother you. It's something to take note of. And another good thing is that the cable comes out of the leg. So it has a very clean look, not messy at all. This is the shade. I don't know what material this is, but this is a shade. Um, assembling was easy, but this part was a little bit tricky. I had to go online and read a tutorial on how to install this, how to get this in here. This thing took a little bit. So the light bulb comes with a, a 60 watt lamp, LED lamp. So this is how you turn it on. But this, the light that you see now is my own. I upgraded it to a 75 watt lamp with more lumens because I found the original light bulb to be a little bit dim. So this is what you get. It gives a beautiful soft wash of light. I think this is very nice for the bedroom as well. Very nice. Lights up the ceiling. See all of that light coming up. Nice, soft and diffused. I really like it a lot. So if you want to purchase this lamp, I linked it in the description box below. So make sure to check it out. And when I was purchasing this lamp, it was a close call between this one and uh, the Brightech Jackson, which is another bestseller on Amazon when it comes to tripod lamps. So I couldn't decide which one I liked more. I ended up getting this one because of the uh, this detail. I thought it was a little bit more feminine and prettier. So if you look at the Jackson lamp, the way that it's the legs are is that they're intertwined at the top. See how these legs are straight? They go straight down. The Jackson is, I feel like it looks a little bit fancier because it, it crisscrosses, right? It crisscrosses, which is a nice look. But for me, I just thought this was like a little bit more feminine appearance. So I, uh, I picked this one, but they're both beautiful, beautiful lamps. And I will link both of them in the description box below because I think they, they look kind of similar. Similar style, you know, mid-century style tripod lamps, both white, uh, both available in brass. So if you like this lamp, go ahead and check out the link in the description box below. And thank you for watching this review. I like this lamp. I don't regret this purchase, even though my space is very small. I think it's very, very stylish. It's definitely a... Uh, a statement piece you know it's it's a it's a very nice piece <laughs> thanks for watching and bye guys